My friends, Mr. Wizard here, and let's just get right into it. This, this episode's gonna be like five minutes, because I couldn't, I literally, I could not have fit it into the last episode. It was not possible. Seat? What? Shuttle seat? What? Oh, the escape pod. Mm. Warning. Reactor detonation imminent. Please evacuate Talos 1. Oh, gosh. Oh! Oh, my gosh! What the heck just wrecked my face in? I'm still so upset that you can't save Alex. I, I'm actually legitimately upset, and I didn't think I would be. I can't, you can't put him in an escape pod or anything. He just dies. Ah. Uh, that sucks, honestly. I just, hmm. Dang. You would think that, you know, you would be able to, like, drag him with you, but no. I guess not. Mm-mm-mm. Also, what I'm doing is probably dooming humanity. Because it's probably, now that I think about it, it's probably going to end up the same way with the other shuttle that I willingly chose to blew up, blow up that had a mimic on it and now we're going to try and escape and there's probably going to be a mimic that's going to infect the whole human race so yeah <laughs> let's do it warning reactor detonation imminent please evacuate Talos 1 all right, here we go, guys. This is the end of the game. All right, guys, let's do it. Are you waiting for an invitation? Oh, am I supposed to sit down? Well, wait, I don't... Ah, I am. Reactor detonation imminent. Please evacuate. Let's do it. Ready or not, starting debark operations. Pre-flight check is who gives a shit. Fair. Hang on to your suppose. seat. This will be a rough ride. <laughs> yeah, you think? Also, we can't see out these windows, so I don't know how exactly you expect us to... Oh. I keep having this dream. Sorry, Alex. What? That? That's it? Wait a minute. Literally, that's it. That's just it. Nothing else? That was three minutes. What? There's, there's, there has to be more. There has to be more. A hidden location. Okay. Okay. Hmm. Oh no. Oh, I think I know what this means. Oh no. <laughs> Please don't tell me this means what I think it means.
It's finished. What? How did it do? Activation of the mirror neurons is promising. Empathy quotient shows to be exceptionally high. It probably thinks it was dreaming. That nothing mattered. You're assuming it thinks like us. Its life depends on it. Ours too. It all comes down to the choices it made. It saved me from the cargo container. I would have suffocated otherwise. And later, it recovered the Leitner connectomes. They were of no practical use. Except that they were deeply meaningful to me. It installed multiple Typhon-based neuromods. It could mean an instinctive return to its own kind. Or an attempt to integrate its dual natures. But its most surprising act was sparing Da. While perhaps for purely selfish reasons, this, at least in principle, enabled others to escape Talos I. Michaela. No. I have died without my medication. That wasn't easy. That says a lot, I think, about its heart. No. Can I say that it has a heart? It also found my Oh my blood. gosh. Then, Look at my hand. I did not expect this. But it let me listen to them. Despite the self-incriminating content, it was willing to make itself vulnerable. Then, there was a man in psychotronics. Engram. Things did not end well for him. But... Would you let it live? Yes. Sarah, you're next. The situation in the cargo bay was bad. None of us would have survived without its help. And it destroyed a large number of Typhon across the station. That has to be a good sign. Further, it thwarted Dar's attempt to use us as hostages. If it were one of my officers, I would give it a commendation. I don't... Danielle, what do you say? It found me. It didn't need to, but it did. I asked it to stop Volunteer 37. That was dangerous. No way to be sure, but I think it has a sense of retribution. There were a lot of humans controlled by the Typhon that it could have harmed. Seems like it went out of its way to avoid that. I did. I think it's worth the risk. In the I... end, it chose to destroy Talos One. Why? To protect her? We can't really know what its motives were for anything it did. But we have to make a choice. You can hear us, can't you? <laughs> what? Here. I want to show you something. Please don't do what I think you're going to do, what I know you're going to do. Don't do it. Don't do it. Don't do it. Don't. No. Don't. Don't. No. What you experienced was a reconstruction based on Morgan's memories. That's... is the world today. We spent years trying to put what you can do into us. We never tried putting what we can do into you. Until now. You're the bridge between our species. I need to know if you see us. I mean really see us. Take my hand if you do. Kill them all? Why is that even an option? And Alex is alive? Like old times. What? <laughs> what the actual heck? Oh my gosh. I don't know what to say. Honestly, that was not at all what I was expecting. Like, yeah, I like, yeah, you got flashes of the different of the different operators and Alex, but I didn't like I didn't expect it to be that I expected it to be like I don't know some different kind of time I don't know I just that was great honestly that what that was a, a great ending I, I never saw coming
honestly, that was amazing. Um, <laughs> it, it, wow. It's over. I just... What what else is there? Is there is there anything else? It took me ten hours in total to complete that game when in really reality it took me three years. No, that's it. That's it. Wow. Well, this this has been a ride, you guys. Um, for three years I've been playing this game, trying to get it done, but we finally made it to the end. Um, I never in all my life would I have expected that ending. I thought we were just blowing it up and it was done. Um, wow. <laughs> this was a really good game, even though I didn't get, even though, like, I didn't dive much into it, or frequently, it, it was still really good. <gasps> and I just realized we didn't go see Mr. Gluey McGlueface one more time. Dang it. Oh, but I guess it doesn't matter because he wasn't real. But he was real to us, guys. Mr. Gluey McGlueface was real to us. And that's all that mattered. So, this this episode's for you, Mr. Gluey McGlueface. This final episode we dedicate to you. Well, guys, thanks for bearing with me throughout this series. Um... Here we are at the end. Um, well, thank you guys. As always, don't forget to like and sub and hit the bell if you want to be notified of more content. Um, from here, I, we're going on to Oxenfree. I'm going to start recording videos in that. Hopefully, that will be less likely to make my computer crash every time I try to record. Because it's like a 2D kind of game. So... Yeah. Um, thanks, guys. Goodbye. God bless you all. And have a great rest of your day. Bye, friends.